feel me? It ain't nothing wrong with me, feel me? Nigga, you just hatin', feel me? That's why you ain't never gonna have no paper, ain't never gonna have no bitches, feel me? Studio again. My nigga Bleak got the character. He like when I do this shit. You know what I'm saying? Look, look, I'm a ratchet nigga. It's off the head. I freestyle all day when I be thinking about my dead. Rashia, she in the back and she looking at me. She know I savage it every time I'm good at it. And that's gonna be at the top. Alright, you can only have. I don't think it's up to you. I'm just letting you know about it. I'm used to it. This is every day, man. I'm going to still do what I do. I'm going to leave my house. I got you. I'm going to smoke my weed. You're going to have to pull me over. You be all right, nigga. Tough, right? Oh, a little gristle, man. Nigga, I've been doing this shit before you was in my nuts, boy. I was doing this shit before you was in my nuts. Yeah, now that say some shit. I've been doing this shit before you was in my nuts. Yeah. Before I had come in my nuts, boy, I was doing this, little boy. Oh, almost threw up. <laughs> he almost threw up. Hey, open the door. Hey, 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 open the door. He almost threw up, Dick. Open the door. Open the door. Open the door, Dick. This shit's structured. Ain't gonna hey, be hey. He, he almost threw up, Dick. We about to pop that bitch open. We got to pop that bitch open. You be all right, nigga. Tough, right? Well, yeah. Ride Wave ain't the only one. Y'all better do y'all research. Ride wave ain't the only one. I don't got paper on, paperwork on the way. A lot of people, bro. It ain't just ride wave. And it's crazy because all of them name it the same song. Nah, ain't in my feeling. I'm smiling. Ain't in my feeling. I ain't mad. I love when they do that. Shit. I ain't mad. When I hear people then took my shit and sang in my shit and put it on records, I be they giving me my flowers, you know. I be liking that when I hear it. It's just you got you gotta compensate me too. This is a business, you know. Just like you do everybody else. They supposed to reach out and be like, man, we need to give your writer share, your publishing, 
on this record we finna put out. Man, you got to stop, man. Man, you ain't got to sue no like me, man. I'm gonna pull up. You talking about suing me? I hope that ain't what he say. Hey, bro, I'll pull up on you, bro. Tell me a number. Tell me a real number, though. I need money. I don't even own the I don't even own the right to the song. Okay for me to be a fan of it was okay for me to be a, a fucking teenager listening to their music and supporting them and shit and fucking with them. But now I'm growing and shit and a rapper. Nigga say a couple lines because I fuck with such a fuck with that. Fuck with a nigga said. Like, well, damn, what a nigga say. Fuck with a nigga say. I said in my song, fucking on that like I stole some shit. I fucking bringing up all these lyrics like I stole some shit. You dumb bitch. If it's public, it's public record. How the fuck I stole it? I ain't stole no shit like a bitch was trying to come up with some shit and I stole they shit. What the fuck is you talking about, man? What's your lame stupid bro? What the fuck is you talking about, man? I'm talking about fat. Man, I got this shit tatted on me, man. What the fuck is you talking about? What the fuck is you talking about, man? I listen to this shit as a little boy. As a little teenager. Live. I live in my Standing on this shit. That's how powerful. That's how powerful a nigga was looking up to these rappers and shit. You feel what I'm saying? All this shit. Lame in a bit. Uh, hey, you got any any anything I ever said in my song? If I repeated in my song. On my, mother, they got paid as fat people. A fucking Paramore, a Drake gave me the okay when I did a little bit from this song. Anybody, anything I ever did, I got the okay. And then get to my, they gonna sue me. And they own the, shit. don't even own the right to the song. Shit, y'all already gonna got okay. What you talking about man? I'm the lame as. Fuck. I want some attention, dog. Uh, I swear that's. I need money. In my ninth grade class at the bus stop, bitch told me she thought I was slow. Cause all I did was listen to music. I ain't talk to nobody. You feel what I'm saying, bro? A nigga love music, bro. I just love that. That's why I got my dog tatted on me. You the only that can't break my heart in this shit. Cause bro done passed away. Everybody else I love. Why you think I'm why you think I'm so good at music, bro? Cause I love the shit. You feel me? I love music. I love all kind of music. So I throw the shit in my music. You know what I'm saying? I interpret this shit. Why the fuck you think a nigga so good at this shit? I grew up praising music, bro. Like what the f like, that ain't even the same no more. It'll never be the same. Right now, think of your, think about your favorite rapper, right? You are, if you are watching them, think about your favorite rapper, right? Ten years from now, overly fuck with them, and they just spit in your face like Fuck you. Not, 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 not. Not what I'm going through, and then all the things that matter that happened. You know how many times that happened to me in this rap game, dog? That I was like, that I looked up to. You feel me? I was looking pretty. Over five, six, y'all f me. You feel me? Yeah, I just wanted to make this compilation real quick with uh, Rod Wave and Lil Bootsy getting into it. You know, it's always the OGs talking shit to the youngsters. You know what I'm saying? Now, he's saying that Rod Wave owns some dues. He's saying that he plan on getting his dues paid back from all the young niggas that didn't listen to him and Swagger Jack, you know? That and listened to him and took a couple of his lines and used this little beat or a sample of his and stuff like that, you know. This just uh, remind me of the OG that in the hood he established and shit like that. And now he's just saying he want the young niggas to pay dues on some shit that uh, he didn't create. He don't own this block and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Like. He try to tell niggas they got to pay money on YG fuck the police. Like NWA made fuck the police. Like, you know what I'm saying? But you want to bring it all the way back to say me little Bootsy made fuck the police. So you jacked the fuck the police. I feel you. But at the end of the day, you jacked that from NWA, but you put your own swag on it. You know what I'm saying? So like we all jacking each other when it comes to music. We all jacking each other when it comes to this type of shit. Unless you really an innovator, groundbreaking ass, you know what I'm saying? 
you know, if you could say a beat that you made from scratch, but like, you know, wordplay, you know what I'm saying? You could say you made up some stuff, but come on, man. You know, you probably heard it in the hood, heard it from somebody that said something that said something. You like, you was like, oh, that shit slick. You end up using that shit in your rhyme, you know? Motherfuckers never know where half this slang and, and shit come from, but you, you know, we in the hood and we hear it and we, we like it and we use it, you know what I'm saying? So it's only a, a certain amount of times where you actually get to create something like that, you know? Or you actually, uh, the real maker copyrighted, uh, and you making something that's like original, you know? But yeah, saying fuck the police and set it off in this motherfucker. Anybody can say that, you know what I'm saying? And it was probably plenty of uh, people that had said it just like that before you said it, you know. But it is what it is. Rod Wave feels some type of way about Bootsy wanting him to pay dues. And it feel like a little extortion right now, but at the end of the day, you know, he did use a couple of his shit. He did, you know. And to go throw Bootsy a couple of dollars ain't shit, but at the end of the day, it feel like OG going to press this issue on some young niggas on the block. You know what I'm saying? That's what it's looking like, you know. But it is what it is, you know. Seems like the uh, OGs won't shut the fuck up and let niggas eat. Y'all had y'all time to shine. Y'all was shining hard. Y'all didn't have nothing to say. Y'all didn't go pay dues. I don't remember y'all going to pay no dues. But as soon as the young niggas make some money, y'all want to pay dues, say my name. <laughs> Put me in the title. Put me in the uh, credits. God damn, nigga. Sit your ass down. When it was time for you to shine in 04, we didn't say nothing. You know what I'm saying? Half of us wasn't even uh, uh, relevant to your ass. You know what I'm saying? You were damn sure wasn't going to nigga schools, breaking niggas off of goodie bags and shit. Then we could have been like, oh, yeah, I seen little Bootsy at school. Yeah. None of that. But... It is what it is. Silence is acceptance. We ain't having it. Like, comment, subscribe.